everybody! Hello! 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 So today was our first day in Copenhagen. Well, apart from arriving yesterday, today is our first day. Yeah. Because we didn't do much yesterday. We were no. just really tired. Well, we, we did. We, we, got, we got stuff done. That, that was the most important bit of yesterday. Yeah. We, we arrived, we got brought here, we basically got in, dropped our stuff and went to Aldi. To be fair though, we were staying in an in a Airbnb and so there were loads of stuff that we would normally have at home that she didn't have and so yeah, we had to buy them and also we bought lots of water mm. and that was heavy. So. Water. Water! Water. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Right, so what have we done today? We got up. Yeah, so at 11 we went um, and met like a bunch of people um, for a, a free tour of the city. It's a free walking tour and you can find them on uh, um, TripAdvisor. Trip Advisor. But they were so good. Our tour guide was Luis. 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 He was from Peru and he was just so nice and funny. Um, yes. And made Game of Thrones jokes. Yeah, it's like whenever whenever people were lagging behind or weren't keeping up quickly enough. You'd be like, enough. guys, come on. Or, or so he, in Game of Thrones, the last yeah. episode. <laughs> so yeah, you just shout like it. Yeah. So let's recap what happened in the last episode of Game of Thrones. So yeah, that was fun. Anywho, uh, what else? We had pre-prepared sandwiches. What you made us some yeah. pre-prepared. Pre and so we had those when we were out mm. and we had our 15 minute break. We visited great um, things. I was telling Chris during the, um, the tour that it was so nice that first of all they had free tours because not everybody can afford those really expensive tours and it was a long tour too, it was three hours. Not to mention most of them are boring, this one wasn't boring yeah, yet. Yeah, this one it he had was lots really of, like, entertaining. Little, he had like lots of little fun stories, yeah. like the one about um, where he went to um, the Baltic, he, he was like, um, what's his name? The, the Mad Bishop or whatnot, he went trying oh, to convert yeah. all those pirates, the winds, and yeah, that was basically fun. arrived. And because he, maybe not to the uh, because because he hadn't been struck down by lightning. He was uh, like, what was it? It was uh, oh, no, pagan it, gods. Because he hadn't yeah. been shot down by pagan gods, they feared him because yeah. he was the one gods wouldn't touch. Mm. So, and that was it. Was just he was just full of good stories like that. Yeah, I I was telling Chris it was so good. Um, I mean, we would have visited all these places, and I think we're, we'll probably still go back in some of them. Um, but it was so good to have the history behind it, mm. because if we had gone, we would have known a little bit about it, but not as much. Yeah, of course. I mean, you would have read what you read on the internet, yeah, and exactly. you would have enjoyed the visual aspects of yeah. things. Like some of the statues and things. And yeah. But you wouldn't exactly know no, exactly what wouldn't. it is. I mean. Look at the town hall. I mean, the Latin on it, yeah. like, uh, what was it, like a boss or something? Mm. He, he, he said, like, give me if my Latin is a bit uh, mispronounced, but uh, I believe it is some damn gangster. Yeah. <laughs> I thought that was quite funny. Um, what else? We had loads of different nationalities coming with us. We had a valley girl, we had. Um, oh my god, our cycles. Geez. Yeah, French people who just came to Copenhagen to drink. Was fun. Yeah, because um, from June first until June fifth, there's distortion. Distortion, and it's basically a big music festival, a festival that happens throughout the neighborhoods, the different neighborhoods of um, Copenhagen. of Copenhagen. And tomorrow is actually where we're staying, um, like not far away. So we might go there. Yeah. I think it will be definitely. Might have Uganda. 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 Maybe. Yeah, it, we're tired. It, it's been it's been a lovely, lovely day, but yeah. it's a bit warmer than what we are now used to in oh, Sheffield. Oh, it's been but great. The weather's been so good. It's we had to tour. We started tour at eleven, and then it finished at two, and then we were at Rosenborg Castle. Was it or Palace? Rosenborg Palace. We were at the, we were at the palace where um, all the royals live. Yeah. Pretty much. And we saw the changing of the guard and. 
from what I read on the internet, I was just expecting it to be a huge thing, but it wasn't. It was about six guards swapping. Yeah. I think I was just expecting it to be quite similar to well, what we, we saw in Buckingham Palace. Yeah, Buckingham Palace has like kind of spoiled it for us because uh, it, it's so grand and like mm. there's loads of them coming in and out. Yeah. Whereas Denmark, they may not have no. as many of the guards, as, I suppose. Or, I don't know. Maybe. But to be fair, we didn't say we didn't stay till the end, so. There might have been and, something else. And um, also, uh, Luis, our tour guide, said that um, it was uncharacteristically uh, small, the guard chain. Yeah. So it might just be this day of the week, or yeah. the fact that they're not here, or yeah. I don't know. Yeah, so then we just found our way back, slowly but surely. We had... Um, we went past the hard rock on that mm. street we kept having to pronounce, because that was the game. Yeah, which is great, because... Strogit, was it? Strogit. Strogit. Struggle. It's like struggle, struggle, but you were trying yeah. to swallow something struggle. at the same time. Struggle. Um, which is basically a big shopping street. Yeah, it had like um, all your regular things, mm. you know, tiger, frozen yogurt, Zara. Kung Pao chicken place. Or was it King Kong chicken? It was one of the two. Yeah, it's been a good day. We had frozen yogurt and that was so nice. Mm. Oreo! Froyo! I, I was going to say Oreo. Uh. <laughs> Oreo Froyo. Um, uh, but that's it, really. Mm. I'm enjoying the flat. The flat's nice. Yeah. We, our flat is quite nice. I might like insert um, before we leave if we can do like a tour of the flat or something. You do a tour of the flat? I think so. Before we leave, maybe. Okay. It's, it's just five. About five. So we're just going to chill for a bit, just rest. I think we'll have, well, think we'll have a bit of a chill. We're both quite tired. Time. Yeah, we'll, we'll have a chill. Yeah. Um, might have dinner in a bit. And then a drink outside. Yeah. There's, like there's a pub literally just outside that window. That's what I keep looking at. Longing. <laughs> there goes my hero. And so we'll have a a drink. Should I show them? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Ah! <laughs> now it's an earthquake. That's the view from the window. To the window. To the wall. Beep 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 beep. So that was our day, and anything else you want to tell them? I've really been, I really enjoyed today. Today was. We found some wacky shot yeah. glasses. I think we have to go back and get those. I've got it. Yeah, there's a I, shot glass uh, with like boobs on it. It's it, really it, funny. It had like a, it was like basically a shot glass, but then it had um, boobs protruding out of the side. Yeah. So instantly, all I could think of was like. Um, the shot slippery nipple. I was just like, you've got to serve a slippery, slippery nipple in that shot. And then there was a boot. boot. Get the shot for coming. I was thinking that, but then I was like, but it's nice. I want to keep it for myself. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's the present. It's the trouble with like getting presents like that. You yeah, want to keep it's them. like you want. Well, see, I have trouble. I can't give a present to someone if I don't like the present. I need to like the present to be able oh, to no, give like, to someone. Oh no, like like so. You can, Ergo, the fact that I like the present, I'm just like, oh, but I want to keep it for myself. Bit please. <laughs> bit, bit please. I think tomorrow we'll take the, um, the tripod with us this time. And we're going to the botanical gardens tomorrow, which I'm really excited about because they're, um, how do you call it, a glass house? Um, greenhouse? Yeah, they're greenhouse. It's like, it's humongous and the pictures look amazing and so I'm really excited for that and to have a nice lunch on the grass area there I think it's gonna be great and then after that we're stop it <laughs> I'm literally just blazing the muzzle and it's like moving all the cushion <laughs> and then after that we're planning on going to a really good market near was it Nyhaven or something like that? It's called. Nyhaven's the harbour. Yeah. I think it's not New far harbor. from it. Nyhaven. I think it's not far from it. So, yeah, I'm really excited. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Let me boop your nose. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow with our new adventures in Copenhagen. Look, here's a new trick. I can turn off the video by booping the nose. <laughs>